Hello everybody and welcome back to another brand new Aviation Jack video, hope you're all doing really well. So today's not a full flight video, uh, we're doing a somewhat tutorial video. Um, so you know MSFS 2020 and the 787 aircraft, I think I've actually, well I know I have, I've actually found a fix for the 787 performance, because as you may know the FPS and uh, the overall optimised performance in the 787 in Microsoft Flight Center 2020 is really quite poor. The, uh, you know, the more Elect electrical avionics to say you have the kind of worse performances so that I've actually found this fix on a reddit forum it's totally safe um, I believe Chewy94 uses it so you know Matt um, it's on a reddit forum and I found it and I thought I'd share it with you all to get a better increase in performance on the 787 and apparently it really really does work so what I'm going to do is go to google chrome and then I'm going to link this below but it's called the mod to lower uh, 2D instrument refresh rate. So all it does is it lowers the refresh rate um, of the displays in front of you. So now that, for example, you know in um, P3D and you can limit the um, refresh rate of the displays from like let's say 50 down to 30. Basically just how, um, you know like 60 FPS, 30 FPS, it's basic, basically like that. Um, but it's basically just minimizing it, so making it less. So as you can see here, if your game is running at 60 FPS, it will refresh a display rate of 15 Hz. And what this does is it just basically makes it a bit slower, but it doesn't. But you don't really notice notice anything. So um, it, it's a really good fix, and it's really useful if you are having problems with the FPS in it. I'm using the first one here, so this one. And all you've got to do, click on it, like so. Download the media file come down here it says FPS fix extract it FPS fix then what we'll do is put that into your community folder which mine is in documents and pop it in here and there it is and that's going to fix your FPS in the 787 just like that let me know if this video helped you if you have actually found that helpful and if it's actually changed your FPS and if it has do let me know um, hopefully it's a quick little video hopefully it works for you all and I'll see you all in another video next time. Probably a full flight video. See you soon. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.